Hey guys, Shadow Knight Paladin here, and welcome back to my channel. Today is another speed paint, but it's a little bit different. This was done for a challenge on Twitter called Tales of 69 Minutes, and it's a little challenge where artists who are fans of the Tales of franchise draw to a certain theme and try to complete the picture in 69 minutes. This is gonna be pretty short. I went so fast even in the original speed. I just had to time lapse this into 400% and it's pretty fast. So the theme for today was coffee shop and well if you are familiar with the Tales of franchise you would know who I'm drawing right now. If you don't, it's Lloyd Irving from Tales of Symphonia. Now, this particular Lloyd is a bit of an AU spin-off since it was a coffee shop and I immediately thought it's gonna be a bit AU-ish even though they do have coffee in the game. Since this was done in 69 minutes and not my usual 4 hour stream, my lines are gonna be rough, even the coloring is not as. My process was a bit screwed up, so my lines aren't refined, it's very sketchy. Even though I did try my best to make it as, as polished as possible. I think I screwed up the hair just a little bit because it was supposed to fly away to the back, but I really wasn't looking at my reference at the time, so you could say he had a new hairstyle for that day. There was a bit of anatomy stick here. The arm was a little bit too thick. So I really enjoyed this challenge. 69 minutes is not a lot of time. It really exercises your creative, your physical, and your stress muscles. It really forces you to try to come up with the best way to depict something. So I had two options at the time. I knew from the moment that I read the theme that I was going to do Lloyd. But the option was either he was going to be a customer sitting at the corner of the cafe since I knew that I won't be able to do the background in 69 minutes so it's either he was a customer or a barista or the cashier like the counter area knowing that I haven't done this in a year I, I stopped at day 42 and it was a year after that I this one started I knew I would I might not be able to complete it with the counter area so I just went with windows. So now we're coloring it in. I still really like how this ended up, especially on the skin tone. It really, the shadows were really nice and defined. Even though it is more scribbly-ish than usual. You can see that the nose is a bit more prominent now than in the past. The thing I didn't even add highlights this time, which I usually do in my regular process. So I did cheat a little. I did grab an official reference of Lloyd from Bamgo itself. And it was just the color pack a little. So it's gonna be fast. I don't need to mess around trying to get the correct color and since my lines weren't as polished they were not connected so i had to manually paint in the lines one thing i do want to learn later on is how to do ambient lighting using on the character itself because you will see later I picked a bluish purplish background 
And even if the lighting, say, was like really bright inside the cafe, I can't always use that excuse and the character sometimes sticks out. <laughs> So to be honest, I'm quite proud of how this piece turned out. Even though it was like super rushed and not as polished as usual, I still feel that I got to bring out the things I wanted to bring out like the shadows and the folds and the clothes. They're more defined without spending too much time on them. I even got to do a little bit of patching up at the end. I had like 10 minutes left and I managed to color in parts of the skin or a part of the clothes I wasn't able to color in the first time. So the idea here was to get everything basic down, to get the main picture out, and then patch it up later. Usually I would patch it up when I see it, but 69 minutes isn't a lot. Now we're working on the background, on the table a bit. Originally, I wanted to do like an olive greenish color, but it clashed a bit with his coat and the background, and it became too colorful. So I went with something more tame. Now I'm trying to add in like the w the windows reflection. Decided it wasn't a good idea. Added some fog, and then I'm gonna add some rain later on. So it, the fog really had this nice effect on the windows. It added this nice little texture to it. So we're coloring in the lines now. See, I had a lot of time. I even managed to color in the lines. In the, in the past 69 challenges I managed to do, when I first was doing it in like day 20, I, I wasn't able to color in the lines. It was sad. But I'm better now. I'm faster now. I know what to do. I'm actually not sure what day this already since I did stop for a year. I had to take care of college for one. And I had thesis. So I had to stop doing my daily morning 69 minute challenges. So we're nearing the end of the stream because I'm already fixing in the patches and stuff. So if you have any questions or anything, suggestions, feel free to leave them down in the comments. I hope you enjoyed. I, I had a lot of fun doing this and I might continue trying to participate in this challenge. Follow me on uh, Tumblr, DeviantArt, and Instagram, and see you around!